polled, the tables chose the number of candy bars sold at a chocolate store over three days. All right. What is the best estimate for the total number of chocolate, I guess chocolate bars, or total amount of chocolate, let's say total number of chocolate bars, sold on these three days? Pause this video and have a go at this. All right, now let's do this together. Now, it looks like all of the choices, there's a lot of different ways that you can estimate. You could try to find the closest 10, you could find the closest 100 when you're thinking about these numbers. And what you're trying to do when you estimate is just try to get to friendly numbers, numbers that are easy to do mathematics with. Now, when I look at the choices, they've all, they all look like a clear number of hundreds. Even 1,000 is exactly 10 hundreds, 700, 900. So if I were to estimate and want an answer that's a clean number of hundreds, it's not going to be exact, I would try to just estimate what hundred is each of these closest to. So for example, Friday, 111. Well, we could think about the hundreds on either side of that. You have 100 and you have 200, and this would be halfway between. Now where would 111 be? 111 is going to be much closer to 100. Maybe it'll be something like this. So you can see it's less than halfway of the way between 100 and 200. And so if I had to estimate it to the nearest 100, I would estimate this as being roughly 100. Now we can do the same thing with, the, with Saturday. We can see that's between 400 and 500. Let me do the same idea. So if this is 400, this is halfway, this is 500, where would this number be? Well, it would be roughly right around here someplace. And so it's more than halfway of the way from 400 to 500. It's beyond this halfway point or this midpoint. And or another way to think, it's closer to 500 than 400. So I would estimate this as 500. And then last but not least, we can look at, let me do this in a new color, Sunday. And it's between 200, sorry, my writing's getting a little bit messy, and 300. And this is the halfway point. And 294 is really close to 300. It's something like right over there. So this one is definitely more than halfway, very close to 300. And so once again, if I were to estimate between 200 and 300, I would pick 300. And so to estimate the total number, I would add 100 plus 500. Let me do that in that same color. Plus 500 plus 300. Sunday, 294 is much closer to 300 than to 200, and I'm trying to get everything to the closest 100. And so this is plus 300. And so what's that going to be? If I have one of something plus five of something plus three of something, I have eight of those things. In this case, I'm talking about hundreds. So 100 plus 500 plus 300 is 800. Or another way to think about it is, oh, sorry, I made a mistake. <laughs> sorry. If I have one plus five plus three, that's nine. So if I have 100 plus 500 plus 300, that's going to be equal to 900. 900, and, or another way to think about it, 100 plus 500 is 600, plus 300 is 900. And that is choice B right over here.